Um, just to kind of give you some context on my story, a few years ago I, I started uh, I started blogging from my English classroom. I've been an English teacher for you know, three years and just really started using the blog as a way to share my ideas and share my experience in the, in the classroom. And uh, it was working really great and I was working at a charter school uh, in, in West Philly and I was, I was blogging with those kids and, and, and working with uh, a one-to-one -one, uh, laptop program there and, and it was really cool to see the kids like really engage in these social spaces. Um, and then kind of the rug got pulled out from underneath me uh, halfway through my, uh, or actually at the end of the, my school year there in 2000, 2010, two, 2010, yeah. Um, and I, 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 all of a sudden I lost my job, and uh, along with uh, several others because of budget cuts. And uh, after that I pretty much uh, was kind of lost in trying to think of what I was going to do in order to get back on the horse. Um, one of the things I went to right away was I realized that I had this like group of educators that I connected with daily through Twitter and through, uh, through blogs and, and through you know basically having a personal learning network at my disposal. And I thought, what what would be the best way to put myself out there and to try and find a new a new uh, a new path uh, than, than using my blog and really being honest and, 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 and transparent and, and really kind of expressing my vulnerability and the idea that I need I need I need something I, I need something from these people. Um, and I wrote a blog post, and I, I think I titled it uh, "Resume Resume Available Upon Request." And um, within hours uh, of tweeting it out, uh, I, I, I got all these comments and, and, and offers from different people and direct messages. That it was just humbling to think of, like this this network of teachers that I, I, I connect with on a daily basis was was there for me in one of my hardest times in my professional career. And as a result, I. Um, I, I, I connected with a, a principal in Burlington, Massachusetts, named uh, Patrick Larkin. And he and I had been, you know, connecting and reading each other's blogs and, and sharing ideas uh, through this network. And uh, he invited me up uh, for a, uh, for an interview for a position uh, at their high school as an instructional technology specialist. And uh, they went, they were going one to one with the iPad and need somebody to facilitate that uh, that launch and help with it. And uh, I jumped at the opportunity. So. I think the moral of the story is the idea of, of, of keeping a, a personal learning network and actually maintaining it. It doesn't, it doesn't just mean you can just throw yourself out there on Twitter and say a few things and then all of a sudden you, th this, this opportunity can happen. This, this, takes, this takes grooming, this takes uh, engagement. It, it, it's, you have to be an active participant in, in these types of forums um, and, and constantly share and be transparent and really, really open up. Um, and, and, and you know, a lot of good things can happen, not only learning, um, but the great reading, the gleaning ideas from other teachers and, and seeing what other classrooms are doing and, and the idea that you know having a shared culture is, is much better than, than working and teaching in isolation and uh, you know having the opportunity to pretty much have a you know career revival as a result of this network is, is my biggest stamp of approval and should be a way in which we can take our students and what they're doing uh, and help them build networks as they go out and, you know, into the world, world and into college and, and so they can basically use these networks to highlight their talents, to highlight themselves and really create that digital portfolio um, that, that, that is eventually going to be almost like a prerequisite for anything that we do. Um, so again, it, it's really benefited me, it's benefited my career, um, and I, I can't imagine not opening up my, my tweet deck on a daily basis just to see what my, my personal learning network's doing, to see what great ideas they're, they're, they're sharing and putting out there. And it's just a, it's a great forum, and you know, I, I really hope that more and more people start to see that as a way to learn um, constantly. You know, the idea of lifelong learning can, can always sustain with a forum like